What's up guys? We're coming at you with a new video with tips to solve small problems. Hopefully these tips will make your day run a little smoother. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to Crafty Hackers to be the first to see our new videos. And give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. Okay, here we go. Everyday problems. You know that slimy soap residue that builds up in the soap dish? Here's a way to keep it off the soap. Just put rubber bands on either side of the soap dish. Your soap will be suspended in the air and slime free. Don't you hate it when a book won't stay open while you're reading? New books especially can cause this problem. Here's a quick solution. Grab a hanger with clips on the bottom. Clip it to your book. Now your book will stay open, hands-free. That's much better. Sometimes packaging is really hard to open, but here's a trick to make it a breeze. Put a bit of nail polish remover onto a Q-tip. Then apply the nail polish remover to the back of the cardboard packaging, where it's glued to the plastic. The nail polish remover acts as a glue solvent, making it easy to pop open the package with hardly any effort at all. Can't get the candy package open? Use two coins. Put a coin on either side of the packaging, right next to each other. Then tear the package in opposite directions. Enjoy! This works for large packages as well as the small ones. Want to close the package back up when you're done? Grab a wide straw, fold it in half and cut the corners of the folded parts. Open up the straw and cut the top middle section out. Cut open one half of the straw and spread it open. Wrap the candy wrapper around the straw section that is still intact. Fold the straw over and clip the open-ended side of the straw over the package. So simple and easy, right? Is your butter too cold for spreading? Here's a quick butter hack. Pour some hot water into a glass. Let it sit for a minute to get the glass nice and hot. Put a pat of butter onto a plate. Once your glass has been thoroughly heated up, pour the water out and put the glass over the butter. This will warm the butter, making it easier to spread. Trust me, it makes a big difference. Here's an easy way to open a container of milk without spilling. Pull open the flaps, then pull gently on the corners. No need to cry over spilled milk. Clip the milk container back together with a chip clip. Don't sweat the small stuff. Bra straps showing through your top? No problem. Get a couple of paper clips and fasten them together. Remove your bra and fasten it at the back. Now you're going to clip the paper clips onto the back of your bra straps. Bye bye, bra straps.
Here's a pretty cool tip. You can create your own magic makeup wand from an old highlighter. Watch. Pull out the parts inside the highlighter and soak them in hot water to clean off the extra ink. Pull the pieces out and set them on a paper towel. Apply a makeup remover with a cotton pad to the highlighter parts. Make sure you scrub all the highlighter ink off. Clean the felt tip as well. Fill a bowl with makeup remover and soak the highlighter pieces. Once the pads soak up the makeup remover, put them back inside the highlighter case, which you should wash out as well. Put everything back together. Now when you make a mistake with your makeup, you've got a magic makeup wand to erase your mistakes. You can do the same thing with nail polish remover and use it on your nails. Just label them so you don't get the two mixed up. Voila! If you love spiral hair ties but hate it when they get stretched out, here's a quick fix. Just soak the hair tie in a bowl of hot water and watch it shrink back to its original size. Wait until it's cool and put it back in your hair. Wow, just like new. Is your mascara all dried out? That's easy. Just soak the mascara tube in hot water, then watch your mascara come back to life. Need to quickly fix your eyebrows? Try chapstick. That was pretty simple, right? Make life easy with these hacks. Got a bunch of products in your bathroom cabinet? Make your own Lazy Susan. Just grab two pie tins from any dollar store and a handful of marbles. Pour them into one of the tins. Now set the other pie tin on top. Place your products in the top tin and spin them around until you find what you're looking for. You're pretty just as you are, but if you want to play with curves, try this. Measure some foam padding for your bra. And cut it out. Use a cup to measure two circular arcs on each side of the foam. Cut the foam into a sort of oval dome shape. Use double-sided tape to fasten the pads in place. Now you've got a more curvy look. Did a moth get to your favorite shirt? Fix those little holes with this. Lay out a piece of parchment paper. Push the holes closed and cut out a small square of valise line and some double-sided fusible. Put the valise line square down first, then add the fusible square. Put a cloth over it and spray it with water. Iron it with a hot iron. Now the hole is mended and the shirt is saved. Got scuffs on your favorite pair of shoes? No problem. Put some makeup remover on a cotton pad and rub the scuffs away. Need an eraser? Try using a rubber band.
Twist the rubber band onto the end of your pencil and rub it on the pencil marks. They will rub right off. Need to light a candle? Don't burn your fingers with those little lighters or matches. Use a spaghetti noodle to light those hard to reach wicks. And those are our tips to solve your little everyday problems. If you found this helpful, be sure to subscribe to our channel. And thanks for watching Crafty Hackers. Ciao!